it goes like this. First, data is acquired. Then when data is acquired, it has to be sorted. After it's sorted, it will likely be used. And after it's used, you should always back it up. You may need to store it for days, months, years, or even longer. That's where Amazon S3 Glacier comes in. Amazon S3 Glacier is a secure and durable service for low-cost data archiving and long-term backup. S3 Glacier claims that it can offload the administrative burdens of operating and scaling storage to AWS, Amazon Web Services, so users don't have to worry about everything that comes with that process. If you're on the lookout for a new cloud computing solution, then you should check out Amazon Glacier. And if you're just starting your search, then you should visit our website at technologyadvice.com to view articles on software and see how we can better help you and your company find exactly what you need. Go ahead and click that link on the upper right-hand side of the video to see more. Also, don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more wicked awesome videos. Amazon S3 Glacier, which we'll refer to as Glacier after this point, operates three storage classes for different access patterns and storage durations. Instant Retrieval, Flexible Retrieval, and Deep Archive. Glacier's Instant Retrieval Storage delivers low-cost storage with milliseconds retrieval. In contrast, Flexible Retrieval handles archived data that does not require immediate access but needs the flexibility to retrieve large sets of data. Glacier's Deep Archive offers long-lived, high-performance archive storage for purposes like compliance and digital media preservation. All Glacier storage classes support unlimited scalability, and have 99.999999999% data durability. Glacier streamlines vault operations. Users can retrieve information such as the vault creation date, the number of archives in the vault, and the total size of all the archives. Vault operations are specific to particular AWS regions. When users list vaults, Glacier returns the vault list from the AWS region that they specified in the request. An AWS account can create up to 1,000 vaults per AWS region. Glacier prepares an inventory for each vault periodically, every 24 hours. Glacier provides operations for users to upload, download, and delete archives. Each time the user uploads an archive, Glacier generates a new archive ID. Users can even upload an archive in a single operation or upload it in parts. Downloading archives on the platform is an asynchronous operation. Access to Glacier requires credentials that the system can use to authenticate requests. When granting permissions, admins or AWS account owners decide who is getting the permissions, the resources they get permissions for, and the specific actions admins or owners want to allow on those resources. AWS offers the following tools for monitoring Glacier resources and responding to potential incidents. Amazon CloudWatch Alarms lets users watch a single metric over a specified period. If the metric exceeds a given threshold, the software sends a notification to an Amazon SNS topic or AWS auto-scaling policy. CloudTrail records actions taken by a user, role, or an AWS service in Glacier. Trusted Advisor inspects the AWS environment and then makes recommendations when opportunities exist to save money, improve system availability and performance, or help close security gaps. And if after watching all this, you'd still like to check out similar software, then we recommend you research Rackspace, Red Store, Dropbox, and Box. Still not sure if those are the right ones for you? Check out our website at technologyadvice.com for more advice on the technology you're looking for. Finally, feel free to hit this button to subscribe to our channel, or maybe this one to take a look at other cloud storage options. Finally, you can click on this one to see a playlist of other videos we handpicked just for you. We'll see you next time.